And a guest judge for the month of September is Khalil Zaib, who himself knows exactly how to take a beautiful photograph as well as produce some action-packed video. I'm Khalil Zaib, I'm a photographer, um, filmmaker and a photography safari leader and I'm lucky enough to have a, an office at the wonderful Dissington Hall in beautiful surroundings. My photography started when my eldest daughter was born and I picked up a camera in 2003 but it wasn't for another five years before I became a professional wildlife photographer. I initially started with um, mainly the local wildlife which was things like the red squirrels, uh, and the Farne Islands, amazing bird life. I wrote a book about the Farne Islands in 2011, just because I loved the place. Um, but my photography now is mainly based in Kenya, where we take people out to enjoy the amazing wildlife out there. Five or six years ago, I got interested in filmmaking. So I challenged myself to make a documentary about a fell runner doing an incredible um, challenge in the Lake District called the Bob Graham Round. And I made a film about Tony uh, doing that and it won a couple of awards and I thought, well, maybe there's something in this. Um, and off the back of that, I got quite a lot of work on mainly things like running events, bike events, um, so that anything in the outdoors really, which is my bag. And what could be more outdoorsy than your September weather pictures? I was really impressed. Um, I've often said that the, the pool of talent in the, the north of England is fantastic. And I had a bit of a hard time uh, actually selecting the, the winner and the runners up anyway, because there were so many good shots. And it's really nice to see a, a really good spread of a variety of high quality photos. My first runner up is by Judith. I really love this photo, it's very warm. I really like the way the direction of the sun is such that because it's so low in the sky, it really comes through those layers of mist. My second runner-up is by Carolyn. Black and white images are often very good for dull days, and especially if um, you can recreate this level of um, the grades of the tonality uh, going backwards in the image. My favourite picture out of all of them is by Ken. It embodies to me what uh, I was really looking for um, when I was looking through all of the images. It's a, the surface of the lake is a bit like dried paint on a canvas. It's just kind of really crunchy. That's an odd thing to say about a photo, but it's just, it's just another thing in this image that made it really stand out for me. Well done. Congratulations, Ken, and a big thank you to Khalil for helping out there.